waste and a missed opportunity and a disservice to communities across North America to not invest in women's hockey right now. It's an empty arena for now. Players in the Canadian Women's Hockey League aren't running to other leagues just yet. Truth be told, there's 130 girls that are out of a place to play. So um, there's no league that can withstand all of that. Um, and the WHL can't do that. Europe can't do that. Europe has a lot of rules about how many uh, imports they can take, technically. Um, and truthfully, like I said before, we're just not worried about that yet as players. We're really trying to just um, figure out what it is that's next that works for everybody. The CWHL announced on Sunday it would be discontinuing operations because of an economically unstable business model, even though it seemed like women's hockey and the league were gaining traction in Canada. Success-wise, you think about what the women did at the NHL All-Star Game in San Jose. There were two members of the Inferno that went there, Rebecca Johnston, Brianna Decker. They had the best season statistically, finishing first overall, and they won the Clarkson Cup. So it seemed like everything was on the rise, not only for Calgary, but for the league. I really do think that this league has always done an amazing job with the resources we have available. Um, so while uh, we know that, that more fan support is needed uh, in order to you know, establish a sustainable league, um, we need a lot more resources in, in, in the sport so that we can uh, be promoted widely. So now the goal is to find an option that keeps these players on the ice without completely changing their lifestyles. You know, you're always trying to get better, but uh, so we, we already kind of knew about the different opportunities that are out there and now that we're actually in that situation it's just um, uh, it's going to be trying to get more uh, you know not operating off of rumor or whatever trying to get some concrete information to, to figure out the best way to go. There has to be professional hockey up here. Um, there has to be professional hockey in Calgary and there has to be professional hockey in Canada. The league is stopping all operations on May 1st. In Calgary, Kristen Fong, City News.